Go to sleep, you little baby. Go to sleep, you little baby. Mama's gone away and your daddy's gonna stay. Didn't leave nobody but the baby. So it's getting into a later part of what we would think of as the prime hours and we've only had just a few ducks fly overhead it hasn't been the morning we were hoping for certainly so we're going to change our strategy here uh, instead of having ducks fly into the spread of decoys which you have we're going to try to do some jump shooting where we'll be moving in the canoes hopefully get a good shot of some ducks in a bay or just in a, an area where we'd have time to get to shore we found this moose moose trail or some type of a game trail that runs along the lake here and so we're going to try to instead of doing calls and bringing ducks into us we're getting proactive basically is what's happening and we're going to go try to find some birds get out deal with it uh just to the best uh, you know we can because it's just not happening here and it's getting pretty brisk and time to move uh, so we're going to accomplish a couple things by doing this but hopefully also to try to find some ducks for whatever reason they're not really moving we've had two fly uh, overhead maybe in the last half hour but just a mile high and not even within uh, a range where we could shoot and had some others come by earlier uh, too fast and uh, just to kind of get ready for it I guess they definitely weren't coming in to land so it's been a challenging morning but hey that's you know it's the same principles apply to fishing as they do hunting things that make sense one year don't the next seem day to day and so uh, oftentimes with fishing which you know certainly more experience with is if you don't adapt you, that's where you get frustrated or run into problems but if you have some flexibility to your approach you know at least you're trying so that's what we're going to keep doing so uh we got some ducks yeah. matthew got his first duck all right. and uh it was all kind of from changing plans being a little flexible we ditched the idea of sitting in a blind and uh, shivering all morning and went out and, and found some ducks and, and did some jump shooting and uh, we're able to stay pretty warm. i am uh, got water about this deep in my waders and uh, it's nice to be moving that water around rather than just sitting and shivering in it. So we uh, got, Matthew and I would drop each other off or get dropped off uh, on either side of a bay and kind of work towards each other walking uh, in shallow water, you know, sneak in real slow, and then hopefully there's a duck in that bay, and uh, and we're gonna startle it up, and one of us would get a shot at it. You open up the possibility that there aren't ducks in that bay, and you're just going for a little hike in the water, and you also open up the possibility that they'll just like blow out right through the middle, and, and nobody will get a shot at it, but uh, it's pretty fun to just like be out and be moving and hunting in a little bit of a different way spot and stock duck hunting. <laughs>